Welcome back to Senran Kagura Estival Versus. Look at all these freeze pops. Oh, the game is definitely bringing out the more annoying enemies now. that and hit you because I don't want that damn bear. Bang, bang, bang. Again, you gotta ask the question, how do these Wallies have such a wreck? Come on over. Let's end this thing. Both of you need to be together, obviously. Alright, that's good. Perfect. I win. I wonder what some people's obsession with these fang teeth are. I don't exactly find that it makes anime girls cuter. Oh, did he really weave like that? The man left like that, didn't he? Now we go to Yumi, correct? Oh wait, we haven't finished her that word. Huh. But yeah, it's supposed to be Yumi now. Oh. Yumi. Yeah. Am I hearing things? I thought I heard grandfather calling me just now. I look out over the beach, but I don't see him. Just as I thought, I can only hear his voice. Does this mean he's about to move on? 
Then why? Suddenly, a powerful fighting spirit floods the area. The hot sand under my feet turns cold as ice as an instant. The sky fills with dark clouds, churning with the sudden waves in the sea behind us. Whitening strikes the beach, dazzling my eyes with a blinding white flash. Grandfather stands on the other side of the white haze. His eyes hold a menacing glare. His body pumps out so much heat that the rain around him turns into steam. Just facing him makes my entire body tremble. Huh. You mean? Grandfather's intentions are clear. I open my fan and steal myself for battle. I have never danced in the beauty of death with Grandfather. He had been ill since before I entered Genza. But here he is now, protecting his fighting, projecting his fighting aura as if he is in his prime. Grandfather raises his fist and lowers his hips. We instantly close the distance. My fan cr cr crashes with uh, Grandfather's right fist. He follows up with his left fist, but I parry that with my fan. I launch into a forward flip, land behind him, spin and retaliate. I project a mass of ice, but he sweeps it aside with one hand. We close into hand-to-hand -hand combat again. My fan and his fist clash over and over. My mind flashes, and not from the whitening. Every attack I dodge brings another memory back to the fore. His silent smile, his kind words, his warm hands, his rigid back and lonely posture. I hold each memory like a treasure. Of course, treasures need a place to be stored. I imagine a precious box deep within my heart. I can keep all my memories there so they remain timeless. <laughs> Grandfather projects all his strength into one attack. I pour all my feelings into my fan and swing. My fan shatters into pieces. As the pieces flutter downwards, Grandfather sinks into the sand. <laughs> Even as I approach him, he begins to fade. <laughs> Tears stream down my cheeks. I cannot hold them back. Grandfather's bra brows knit. Without any notice, the clouds give way, and the sun shines again in the blue sky. I mean, at this point... At this point, even though Yumi seems to be more of the protagonist with how people look at her, I mean, in a way, you can say that both Asuka and Yumi are dual protagonists. Like, that can be a thing. You can have two main characters. You can have multiple main characters. But you can also have the main character, which people will be like, It's Asuka, wait, no, it's Yumi. And I'm like, oh, I like Yumi more. Grandfather's body continues to fade. I cannot see anything below his chest. I understand what Grandfather is saying. One cannot simply outshine evil, nor burn it away with the raw power of righteousness. Grandfather and us were both lost on that path at one point. To truly bring righteousness to the unrighteous is a daunting and puzzling task, especially since the very definition of righteousness is a question for the ages. And so instead, Grandfather says I should step into the darkness and offer my own light for those who wish to let it guide their way. <laughs> Grandfather gives a white smile. With those last words, Grandfather disappears. 
I try my best not to collapse in the surf, crying. Because I feel that he's watching me from somewhere. Easy. You might want to reword that. Whoa, hold on now. あ、確かにホムラちゃんは強いけど、私はもっともっと強いよ。ユミちゃん、それでもいいの？アスカ、待て待て、私を引き合いに出して話をするな。私はホムラちゃんの真似をしただけだよ。な、なんだと？それでは
Oh boy. Oh, I forgot about the last move. Asuka right now is being dumb going AFK. Come on, we can do it. Oh no. Okay, so since Asuka is fighting, yeah, I gotta attack. Well, never mind. I gotta level up my flash! And she's stunned right now, so good. Oh god, get up. It seems this is the easier way to strip their clothing. <laughs> Uh oh. Whoa, hold on. Oh, jump. Go after Hamra. Probably won't get an A for this. Oh, God. Oh, jump. Hey, I jumped, okay? That's bull. How did you even. Oh, you freaking. Tag team me with your skills. There we go, you're done for now, Asuka. Now let's defeat Hamra. Boom! I win! Easy! Victory! I got a B. <laughs> this is because I took damage. Okay, it's been about a few days for me. This is after I dealt with all the stuff with Destiny 2 with Solstice, and I was just playing Fall Guys again, which... Like... <sighs> that game, 
I don't think I can really play that alone, because when I play that alone, I get even, I get mad a lot faster. And I know a little bit of dialogue already did, but we're going to go through a little, just all of it again. We already did like two sentences. My thumb hurts right now from playing Fall Guys, because at this Because of this broken controller, I don't even trust the movement, so I always push the the stick to make sure that the character keeps on moving. Uh, I, I don't know, man. We only have two more missions for this um, day. Well, three, actually. This one, including two other. Get the stick out of your ass, woman. I mean, again, like, the masochist here is thinking better than you are. You. Real be like seriously, you're, you're I'm, I'm already pissed, and you're just making me even more mad. Like, you can't keep thinking like this. You said something terrible. It happened. This is your only chance to make up for it, or you're just done for. You'll have this on you forever if your sister just drags you out of here. It's like fine then, or your whole team drags you out, and then you don't get to say goodbye. Like, eat. you're being stubborn. Seriously. Like, what the hell? Like, seriously, right now she's not even taking these, what are basically to her compliments. I did get to max level in code vein so if Winston gets on tonight we can get that thing finished that I would I would be very happy if he did because then I could have like almost be done with this game because we're definitely doing shinobi girl heart missions th today at least some and I know each character has five and there's a lot of characters in the game so yeah I don't think there are any other finishers here, so hold on. Let's see. Need to still up that Yang. Here we go. And 
That'll make it be it. And then with a little of this... It's not done yet. Well then a little bit of this. There we go. It's all over. She's completely stripped. Don't tell me you're gonna just run off again. We'll kick out of it. There's no need to be in a dumbass rebellious phase. That doesn't do you any good. I'm getting blinded here. I can't read the subtitles. Well, there's that then. That will be the end of this episode. 